It's a lot of themes you can download. This is just the first page. There's three pages. There's 115 themes you can actually download. So I'm just going to pick any theme at random. Harry Potter theme. There you go. Just click it. Right. And again, I'll tell you what firmware you need up here. 3.70 and up. My firmware is official Sony 3.90. So I can basically download anything. So once I've done that, Download Harry Potter theme. I don't know why I'm doing this because I absolutely hate Harry Potter. So then you just save it. It should take two to three minutes. Uh, two to three minutes, sorry. Two to three seconds. I haven't actually done this, so I'm just going to do it with you. you save it to my desktop. Don't bother renaming it. Just save. There you go. Done. Right. Just minimize that. There it is. Look on desktop again. Harry Potter theme. Now. Go back onto PSP. Go on to USB connection. And then, as I said, the fourth doesn't come out. Just go to my computer. Removable disk. And then into PSP. If I've got a folder called Theme, make a new one, put it in caps lock, and call it Theme, not Themes. Theme, T H E M E. And go into that. These are the themes I have already in my PSP. So you can either copy and paste as you can do with the game, but I'm just gonna drag it. And I'm just gonna put it there. But there you go. It's already in. So get it 
that. Got PSP. P. Back. Good settings. Go down to theme settings. And then it should say theme, color, and background. Theme. And then just go to the one that you have not seen before. X, apply it. It says if you overwrite the currently saved custom theme will be de deleted. It won't be deleted. It will still be in your theme selection. It's just, it wouldn't get out of the whole PSP thing. It will still be there. It should say please wait. And there you go. Harry Potter theme. Um, for if you want to up your upgrade from whatever you have to 3.90, I will also give you a link. And when you go onto theme settings, and it doesn't give you three options: theme, color, and background. You do need to update. You don't have to, but I'd recommend you update to. 3.90 so you can actually put themes on so if you struggle or anything just write back to me and I will try to get back to you so uh, like I say is good luck